Hi, my name is Richard and I have gout arthritis. My gout flares started for the first time a few years ago when I was 42 in the big toe of my left foot. I first thought I might have sprained my foot, but this felt different. During the first three years, the pain was in my big toe and it was really full on and occasionally on the side of my foot as well. It basically looked like someone had painted my foot with red paint and slightly pumped it up but it only lasted on and off for about one or two days. Blood tests showed that my uric acid levels were a bit higher than they should have been, but nothing too bad. My doctor said, let's keep an eye on this. It's also important to say that at this time, I wasn't eating high levels of food that have been traditionally associated with gout arthritis, like seafood, red meats, or drinking lots of beer. Then in August 2020, I went away for a boys weekend. I had a few more beers than normal, and woke up in the middle of the night in utter agony. I didn't go back to sleep. I just stayed awake tossing and turning and ibuprofen didn't really make any difference. I couldn't walk properly the next day and the pain didn't go away either. I just hung around flaring up and down. I went and saw my GP the following week and they asked me to get a blood test. My uric acid levels were super high. They were over 0.52 and should have ideally been 0.36. I got a prescription for prendazone. It definitely eased the pain, but it didn't take it away properly. After a few weeks of hobbling around the house, I felt like I'd massively damaged my left foot, and so went back to my GP. They suggested I might need to go on to allopurinol to deal with my gout. They referred me to Auckland Hospital. I had a session where I saw a specialist. They gave me some crutches to help me with my mobility and a prescription for paracetamol, and said, go back to your GP if it still hurts in a couple of weeks time. Nothing changed, so I went back to my GP. They said it's time to try allopurinol. I said, all good. I just wanted the pain to stop. About 24 hours later, I had my prescription and took my first pill, which was 300 milligrams. Within the next 24 hours, my pain had drastically reduced. It had gone from about nine and a half out of 10 to about three out of 10. I'm really comfortable talking about gout arthritis and the journey it sent me on. You don't need to put up with this awful condition and everything else that comes with it, like the impact that it can have on your mental health, your ability to work, drive a car, or do things with your family. I can even have a couple of beers now without it affecting me, just don't overdo it. I also take my allopurinol every day and drink heaps of water. Occasionally I'll ask my GP if I can have a blood test to check if my uric acid levels are okay. I hope this helps and encourages you to start talking about your own experiences with gout arthritis and also chat to your GP as well if you haven't already, and even one of the Arthritis New Zealand educators. If you would like to share your gout experiences, please contact us via email or phone.